Instagram live too. Yeah. Yeah, let's get ready. Let's check this mic. Let's get it, let's get it, baby. Check the mic, check the mic. Check, 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 mic, check. Mic, check, check your mic. Yo, 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 yo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me get it going. Hey man, say man, hey man, say man. If y'all don't know what's going down, man, hey man, I need y'all to understand. It's real and it's true in real life. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, let me go ahead. If y'all don't know me, if y'all don't know me, if, if y'all don't know me, I am DJ MC, Mr. Low Key. You know what I'm talking about? This is true for life. Radio, you know what I'm talking about? This is what true is not just a real nor a slogan. This is a real life lifestyle we live like this, man. RP to the pill. It's Luke's the bun, man. It's a pleasure and an honor, man, right now to be doing this interview, man. Because at the end of the day, like I'm telling my, tell, you know what I'm saying, telling my boy, man, I've been doing better as far as trying to reach and not to my independent clothing lines, you know what I'm saying? Like again, I gotta give my credit to Umba Guru, and she was the first one I actually pulled up on and actually got some shit from, and I've been still, uh -oh. okay. Yeah, I've been steady making the posts and trying to see what to do, you know what I'm saying? So I linked up with another artist, another clothing line designer, man. And this guy right here, man, another artist, man. Man, talk to him, man. Go and give yourself a quick introduction one time, man. What's up? What's up, y'all? It's your boy KJ Kajar. You know what I'm saying, man. I'm from Clute, Texas. Yeah. I started this brand. I really wanted to start this three years ago because I wanted to be like, what's a slogan that I haven't like seen? Yeah. And you know, at first, I did the ones with I love BBWs for the big girls. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Got to do it. That one went. That one went stupid. Yeah. But this was always in the chamber because. I'm gonna use it because I used to be really big. I used yeah. to be damn near 400 pounds. Damn. So that's why I was thinking like, man, I'm gonna use this. Yeah. Fat. Huh. Fat. It, it kept popping up in my head for three years. Yeah. So I was like, all right, well. So when I started doing the BBW stuff, all that shit going on. Yeah. So I was like, all right, it's going. And then I was like, I need something new. I need something for everybody. Yeah. I need something for people that's gonna actually, I want to wear this. All right. So one day I was just sitting in my apartment and just just chilling. And I was like, and it just popped up and said, fat. I said, like, man, what I'm gonna do with fat? Yeah. Fearless and talented. I said, yeah. bingo, we got action. Yeah. <laughs> I said, I ain't never seen nobody use that. Yeah. I ain't never seen nobody just put that, use that as a thing. Because when you think of fat, you think of insecurity. Ah, uh, really? I'm gonna make your insecurity a security. Man. Just because you big don't mean that you can't be that person. Man. What I'm gonna use it as. I'm fearless and yeah. talented because you gotta be fearless to yeah. be talented. Man, you know what I'm saying? come on with it. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm here to drop gems and jewels. That's what's up, up, man. That's what's up, man. So how long you been running with the brand now? Man, that's been since ooh November. Yeah. I started like right after my birthday because I wanted to do something different. Yeah. So what I did really to really push it, I asked people from the city of Houston because I'm from the country. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Have you ever heard of? Like Jackson, yeah. Yeah, 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 that's where I'm from. Okay. Out there in that Brazoria County. You yeah, know what I'm out there by the water. Yes, sir, the yeah. surf side. Ah, uh, really? Yeah. Yeah. So I, I asked a couple people from Houston, I was like, man, would y'all rock this? Yeah. And be honest. Man, that's love. Yeah. Man, that's, man, hey. Yeah, yeah. Go run with that. Stay there. I was like, all right. And I asked people from my house, like from down there. Yeah. They was like, yeah, we'll run with that. Yeah. So I said, all right, cool. You know what? I just ran with it. Yeah. But I do have to shout out to two people that's really making it happen, though. Yeah. So shout out to my hunger, Jalen and Crucial from San Antonio. They the I ones really. that make the clothes and stuff. So yeah. if you need some clothes from them, just hit me up and I'll give it to you. Yeah. So that's a bit, man. Hey, man, I definitely like the design. Like I say, man, I definitely like it, man. Yeah. Fearless and talented, man. Like when I seen that, it was like, hey, I liked it. I thought that was live too, cause it was yeah. like, shit. I feel like I'm fearless and I'm talented. Got you know what I'm saying? So that. Yeah, I'm fat too, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I ain't I ain't the finest, you feel me? I ain't hey. just swollen and bold at the end of the day, but hey man, I ain't no hold though, you feel me? So fearless and talented, man. That's what's up, man. I definitely respect you and your you know what I'm saying, your brand and your hustle, man, and you know what I'm saying? Like, see what other else things you got going on, you know what I'm saying? Man, for right now I am taking a break in July, because I got my son the whole month of July, so I'm really? more focused with him, you know, I know get, right. to, get to bond with my son a little bit more, Straight you know what I'm saying? But, uh, I, I do, I do, I was going to do a couple shows, but I was like, nah, I'm going to wait till August. Yeah. Because I do, mm. ladies, I do need y'all in August because I am doing a photo shoot in August. If you want to be in it, yeah. let me know now yeah. so we can get it arranged. 
But as for all I've done, besides doing this, I've done you know big name shows and I met big time artists. Yeah. Like Bun B, that was that was crazy. Ah, uh, really? And when I met ESG, that was even crazier. Damn. What's she tell me about that, man? How did that happen? Honestly, I'm gonna I'm take you back to like years ago, man. Yeah. So at first, I didn't know what I really wanted to do, and I got a bro, you know, my boy Devin, Jimmy Bones, man. Ah, really? And I used to do be with shows with him all the time. Yeah. Be on the mic with him every so often, just bullshit and talking ah, shit. Ah, really? And you know, I'm kind of. I didn't know I was popular until I seen my name on a poster. Yeah. So I put my name on the poster and my partner Duck put me on. Yeah. And uh, I said, man, ain't nobody gonna come to this club tonight just cause of me. But I'm just a, I'm a regular. I ain't yeah. no cool dude. <laughs> then I got in there, I was like, God damn, I don't know. I know all y'all people was out here. Yeah. Oh, we came cause we seen you. I said, like, oh, alright. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. That's but live. What really what made took off uh I Linked up with Roy Ashley, man, if you don't know who she is, but yeah. Yeah, I think I heard the name before. Yeah, I linked up with her, and then that's when she started doing shows. So the first show I did was with ESG. Huh. And then, you know, that show was that, that show was pretty live, you know yeah. what I'm saying? It's an H-Town legend. It's my first time being around uh, uh, really? an H-Town legend that's actually really a big part of H-Town. Uh, really? You know, a lot of people don't understand how big ESG really is Straight to Houston. Up. Nah, Just like Pimp C and Bun B. <laughs> Even up. though they're not from Houston, they still a big part of oh, the Texas definitely, culture. Definitely a big part. Big salute to ESG because he's definitely a living legend, a real OG. I'm talking about I still with this yeah. great taste. Me too. ESG in it. You Me know too. what I'm saying? Like, All the time. Like hearing his voice with those Old school classics, it's different, man. It means a lot, you know what I'm saying? So big big salute to you for you know what I'm saying, see it getting close and working with ESG yeah, and big salute to ESG and everything, man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah. then so uh then that, that next week I met one of my favorite running backs I've I've seen growing up, Chris Johnson. Huh. And Lindell White at the same yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah. My partner Ant was doing the show and I went out there with him. Yeah. And then after that, we did the Bun B and Big Frida show. That was, I ain't gonna lie, that was crazy. That was crazy. Damn. I was like, damn, Big Bun B, Big Frida, it was a lot of people in there. Yeah. And then I did the Beat King show after that. Yeah. And then, uh, what's it, what's it, then we did Rizzo Rizzo and Sauce and them. Okay. Sauce. Man, it was cool. Damn. So then I started working with a lot of people after that. Like, my popularity grew off of that. Yeah. I still thought I was a nobody. Yeah. Just like, I said, like, man, I ain't. I'm, you know, I'm just I'm always downplaying it so much. Uh, really? But I didn't really see that I was really up and up there like yeah. until I started going out. Because when I went to different places, I was in Houston. Yeah. I didn't know that many people like, oh, KJ, I've seen you before. Uh, How the fuck you see me? Yeah. I don't know you. How do you know me? Yeah. So like it was it was crazy, like, you know, and the team that I, I run with, everybody yeah. got their own thing going, man. Uh, really? Especially shout out to my boy Taj on the keys, HOC yeah. Jimmy Bones, Dollar Bill, yeah. uh, Shamar, you know. Just shout out to my girl Nene, you know, we yeah. got more people in the group. I yeah. can't really think of that because it's, it's so much I got to talk about. Damn. Here, bro. For real? Yes, sir. Damn, so it's more than just clothing line. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I got like a whole organization and like different parts and things like that going on. Yes, sir. Damn. Uh, you know, that's my brother group. We used to call it HOC. Yeah. So we all just do everything differently and separately. Damn. You know what I'm saying? We all support each other and what we need to do. Yeah. And I asked him, like, man, what you think about this? He yeah. said, bro, go with it. Yeah. He said, that's different. I ain't, I ain't never seen anybody use fat. Straight up. Because somebody else like, oh, that's lame. Right, man. Right, Why right. are you using fat? Right, Why right, right. are you using that? Right. Well, why the fuck not? See, I like it. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Business and talent. See, like, I feel like you take, you know what I'm saying? Like how you say you'll take something that could be an insecurity and make it a security. Yeah. So I can see that happening. Like, yeah, yeah. I definitely feel like I'm fat. How me fat all day, if that's what that means. Exactly. Fearless and tell us, I'm fat. I'm fat all day, I would have exactly. shit it out there. You know what I'm saying? You, you, got, you got to be like that, man. Right? Yeah. Because well, how people going to take you seriously if you're not going to push what you want to do? Ah, uh, really? You know, you got to yeah. really, you really got to be confident with you. Because I don't want my son thinking like, okay, my daddy tried to hear do it. No, yeah. your daddy still do it. Straight up. Still do it. <laughs> Even if I'm working a nine to five, still, yeah. making yeah. big money, this still going to give me money too. I know, that's right. So you know hey, what I'm saying? Hey man, you gotta keep the hustle going, man. That's one thing about us, man. We're gonna keep the hustle going and we're gonna come up with talented new things and, and, and create a business off of that. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully that business can change generations and we can change the generation of curse or whatever in the past. We can change it all the way up. Right, right. right. You know what I'm saying? By having a, a 
a, a positive thought and idea and, and, and made it into some money, man. You know what I'm saying? So that's too, so, man. That's too, man, because a lot, of, a lot of people don't really, like, try. Like, try. It just... It's, it's, it's a scary thing. I ain't going for it. it. It's scary to try something new. Yeah. It's really like, damn, how am I really going to do this? Yeah. How is this going to work? Like, am I going to get, you know, the revenue? Like, you know, you're not just going to start off right off the bat making a thousand dollars in one week. Right. Some days you might get a hundred dollars. Right. Some days you might get no dollars. Right. <laughs> it's just how you market things right, man. Say that. That's why you got to tell people. That's why I tell people all the time. If you yeah. really going to market something, yeah. you got to have at least a, your closest homies. A lot of women. Uh, women, women gonna, yeah. women gonna make everything happen. Straight up. Cause a lot of people, I'm gonna be trying to tell why y'all be having a bunch of dudes. That's gonna cause a bunch of right. masculine. Cause I'm gonna go be, I feel better than you right, in right, your right. own shit. Right, right, right. Instead of I'm gonna help my bro out because I support what he's doing. Straight up. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's real. That's why you gotta have a bunch of females. Yeah. Bunch of, even if they not the best, look like a seven yeah. up to ten. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It, 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 it is. You got to be honest with hey, yourself. Hey, it is what it is. I feel you, though. You know what I'm saying? I definitely, I definitely feel that. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the ladies because they definitely are hey. one of the biggest supporters. You know what I'm saying? And, so. that, and that is one of my biggest supporters, the ladies, man. You know, shout out to the homies that do support me. But it's yeah. the ladies, man. They, they really come through for you, boy, sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah. Straight up and down, man.